you only have about three weeks left for your exam. At this stage, you need to be wrapping up your study of the curriculum. If you've not done so already, perhaps you can use a high yield course to accelerate your studies. If you have finished the curriculum, then it makes sense to use the high yield course to revise material that you might be forgetting. But the key activity at this stage is practice. Over the next few weeks, you need to do as much practice as possible. If you haven't done so already, do all the MCQ based questions in the curriculum. At this stage, you can skip questions in the curriculum that are not MCQ based. Then make sure you go online on the CFA Institute website and do all the assessments that are available there. These assessments are in MCQ format. I also want you to do the mock exams which are on the CFA Institute website. There are three mocks. Two of them are online. The third one is in a PDF format. So you can download that and do that in an exam like setting. Perhaps you can do one of the online mocks early on. And then if you are weak in some areas, study that material and then do the second mock. And then about one week before the exam, do the third mock. So these are questions from CFA Institute that you absolutely must do. If you need more practice, then you can use IFT practice questions. So at a reading level, you can use our question bank. If you want to practice at a topic level, you can use our quizzes. And we also have three mock exams. So there is a tremendous amount of practice material available for you. But I would like to still emphasize that if you have limited time, do the CFA Institute material first. And then once you are done with the CFA Institute material, you can practice the IFT material. That is it for now. Best of luck with your studies.